you know, the hands and knees uh, are, are a temporary fix because I always tell people if you pull a weed, you get two back. So um, if you're looking for job security, pull your weeds. Yeah, <laughs> that's right. <laughs> I learned that the hard way with uh, some thistle. Oh, yeah. I'd... And they are they are relentless. Uh, yeah. I always tell people you have to be patient and persistent with thistles. You can go through and you can, uh, you know, if they're in an area where you can spray them with Roundup, uh, that works very well, or a Roundup-type product. Mm-hmm. Um, but, you know, you'll go out two weeks later and you'll see new ones coming up. Oh, yeah. And uh, you just have to keep after them. And I've seen uh, areas where it's taken maybe two years to er- eradicate them. And uh, if you if you redo a bed where you stimulate the soil, um, uh, oftentimes things appear that were never there before. And those are just dormant seeds laying in the ground waiting to germinate. And when you disturb the soil, here they come. So yeah. um, <clears throat> very important, too, if you have thistles anywhere on your property. Do not let them go to seed. Oh, boy, yeah. Uh, Even if you can just take a weed eater and cut them off and cut them off and cut them off, uh, at least you're not going to have another uh, million seeds distributed (laughs) around the neighborhood. So um, um, that's that's very important. I uh, was out in my lawn the other day, and I uh, was cutting the grass, and I noticed a couple little patches of a of a weed that it almost looks like a ground cover, and it's got tiny little yellow flowers on it. Uh, what what am I looking at there? Do you have any idea? Um, well, my my first guess is I see a lot of things like henbit that are that are starting to flower in the in the yard, and uh, uh, whether it's that or another type weed. Uh, there are many, many good weed controls oh, yeah. on the market. Uh, you know, Bonide has some excellent products, weed beaters, one of them, that uh, uh, will not affect your grass, but it will kill the weeds. And uh, um, there also are some dry uh, type of products that you can put on for weed control. And you want to, you know, if you're using a dry product, be sure that the foliage on the grass and weeds is moist like early in the morning when there's a dew on the ground or maybe after you water uh, but on a day you don't think it's going to rain for 24 hours dry products need to stick to the leaves of the weeds long enough to kill them where liquid products are already wet and uh, they will go in through the leaves and kill that plant root and all 